Hey guys, Halloween Man 2002 here, back with another video on the Victorian Vampire from Home Depot. Let's get into the video. Stirs in coffins, crypts, and the dark places where sunlight dare not creep. Nosferatu. Enter the lair of the seven-foot animated Victorian vampire. Arisen after more than 100 years in repose, the silver screen's most famous fanged fright has returned. With an appetite. His long, hungry teeth show the yellow of age, and his skin, wrinkled and ravaged by countless nights, without so much as a bite or a drop to eat. And his hands are ready to claw for more crower and clots. Under bushy gray brows, his ancient eyes glow a brilliant gold, searching yearning to taste the essence of youth incarnate. Life shall fade into pallid shade as I sop upon your blood. Welcome to your last meal, but you won't be the one eating. <laughs> the seven-foot animated Victorian vampire. Only so the Victorian Vampire is a new prop for Home Depot 2024 this year. And I have to say he's okay. He is a downgrade from last year. Because last year they had the Boogeyman. It's basically the same built. But they got rid of the motor and the arms. So the arms don't move at all. Um, I don't like the eyebrows the eyebrows don't look that great i felt like they should they should have just been like a paint on besides actually putting actual fur on the eyebrows it's it's okay i don't i think the more i watch the video of it the more i hate the phrases too and the voice actor that's just my opinion on him but let me know your opinions down below. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.